Every year around October, we have the Fort Armstrong Folk Festival in Western Pennsylvania, specifically in Catanning, Pennsylvania. This was established in 1971 and has been going ever since. A little bit of history of the area. So the history of Catanning, Pennsylvania is long and varied. The area was originally home to the Lenape or Delaware tribe who named it Catanning, which means the place of the Great River, or at the Great River. In the 17th 50s, the village of Catani became the sieging area for Delaware and Shawnee raids on British colonial sediments during the French and Indian War. The Allegheny River is a 325 mile long or 523 kilometer long river in western Pennsylvania and New York in the United States of America. Movies and TV have been shot here, so some commonly known things such as the show Justified or the Mothman Prophecies have been filmed in Pennsylvania, they often, in Catanning, Pennsylvania, they often shut down a lot of the streets in Catanning to film these um, types of TV shows, uh, and they kind of changed the scenery. The bridge scene in this picture here was actually in one of the scenes from the Mothman Prophecies where they went through and CGI'd and there was actually a, a clip of the bridge collapsing. Um, if you can see in the back there, there is a courthouse as well as a wall at the end of the bridge that they made fit the era of when the movie The Mothman Prophecies was staged. And actors like Richard Gere would have been in the area too for these productions. So the Folk Festival has a lot to offer. So there are chainsaw cut sculptures where there is an artist who is working in a sectioned off area who is actively using a chainsaw to sculpt things like owls or bears, um, different wooden creations, different sculptures for people to keep in their homes and their yards. There's also hand woven wool that is used to make yarn so they can craft different uh, pieces of clothing or different plush animals. On Saturday night of the festival, there is always a fireworks show. So every year they set off fireworks works on the hill over top of the river. They last for about 15 minutes, but there are a good number of fireworks. Um, people tend to take their boats and pull their boats into the river to get the best view of the fireworks while they're being set off. There's also a ton of live music and delicious food. There are um, pretty much anything that you can think of to eat. There are also restaurants downtown, but they set up booths for things like um, a stone-fired pizza, or they have a place called the Beef Tent where they offer different types of sandwiches. Or there are a lot of shows and bands. They do a pretty much well book on two separate stages. While all this is going on, there are horse-drawn carriage rides around the town. So people go ahead and they buy tickets to get on these horse-drawn carriages with their families. They also have a petting zoo where they have the opportunity to pet animals like goats or sheep or ducks. And there are traditional blacksmiths who work in the area who make different goods and a glass blower who actually stands there and blows glass uh, for the people around. They make things like marbles, pendants, vases, shot glasses, and ornaments. Thank you so much for learning about the Catanning uh, Area Festival, the Armstrong Folk Festival that happens every year. Uh, consider checking it out.